will do the tuna sandwich and these are the ingredients that we will be doing so for this I will be using a wheat bread because this is very sturdy I love using this one so what I will be doing is that I will just brush this with butter and then after that I will toast this in the pan so in a hot pan you just toast it with some butter and let it brown on both sides so make sure that you put a decent amount all right and then after that it will look something like this so as you can see I love the color of this one and this is gonna be um, your two base all right so after that in a big bowl all you have to do is to mix in this is about one can of plain flakes in oil tuna um, canned and then this is my pre-made mustard mayo relish and honey and then you will just add this to your sandwich as you can see don't put too much dressing because you want tuna to shine into your sandwich so as long as there's flavor you can actually season this again with salt and pepper I'm gonna add for color and flavor a little bit of paprika. Tuna and paprika goes well together. And of course, see this is multi-purpose, so you can add this to your tuna sandwich. It has flavor as well. And then for color, I'll be adding this red bell pepper dice, a little bit of red onion and white onion for color and for crunch. So as you can see, there's color and texture in my dish. Now, if I'm going to build this one, since this is already toasted, I still want to add a spread on the base. Never forget that. So that will be the glue for your lettuce. So it's very crucial to have your spread first before you place your lettuce so that it doesn't slide around. Okay, let me check my bread. I hope it's not burning. There you go, perfect color. All right, okay. And then after that, that's the time that you can add in your tuna. All right. If you soak this in overnight, this will also taste more flavorful. So I like to put a couple dollops. This is how you do it in hotels. And then after that, of course, we have to put in some freshly sliced cucumber. For texture and for color. And there you have it. You have your tuna sandwich.